what's going on, man? It's Doc Whitfield, man. We're H2O TV at the Paradise Theater, man, for Charlie Wilson and friends. Opening at K. John, we're here with SoulSummer.com, Honor Rocks Entertainment, you know what I'm saying? We're out here raining just before curtains at 8 p.m., you know what I'm saying? We're about to go inside and give you some more of the highlights of what's going on. Man, you watching H2O here at the Paradise Theater, man. Soul Series on the Rocks Entertainment here with Charlie Wilson. We're talking to the great ones, man. Legends, man. Easy Mo B, man. Grandmaster Kaz. What's going on, brothers? Nothing much. Just chilling. I'm standing, like you said, next to the le legendary Grandmaster Kaz. He got a lot of royalty in the building right now. <laughs> Including Charlie Wilson. You know All what right? I mean? Right up. <laughs> And we just a supporting cast tonight. We just came to show love, represent, enjoy some good music. You know what I mean? To have Charlie Wilson from the Gap Band in the Bronx, that's something, that's big. You know what I mean? And even if people, you know, for the majority don't, you know, get it, we get it. And we hear it. You know what I'm saying? So that's what's up. Yeah, I was about to say that. I ain't afraid to say that. Industry, where you at? <laughs> I don't see that much industry in the Bronx tonight. What's up, man? Come out to the BX. Don't be afraid. Word, it's all good. It's the hood. <laughs> <It's> the <eye. laughs> so, some may not necessarily know it. also be a surprise. and also a blessing and a blessing and a breath of fresh air, man. To see two greats here tonight, you know what I'm saying? The BX also representing again, man. Oh, yeah. I feel very, very, very comfortable. I'm, I'm from Brooklyn myself. Um, Grandmaster Kaz, if anything, he BX material. But I'm from Brooklyn. You know, I, I'm, I'm very comfortable. I'm very at home, man. Very. You know, and this is my this is my own neighborhood right here. You know what I mean? The whole the concourse from Burnside Avenue up to Fordham Road. That's me. You know what I'm saying? You got old stories about the oh, Paradise come Theater. On, crazy. We used to sneak in here, man. Uh -huh. Watch movies all day long. All right, up in here, go through the back way on Creston Avenue, and go through the door. We good bread. You know what I mean? It, it was just a good time, time we was young, you know what I mean? It was about going to movies, you know, your little O.E. and your little, your little joints and whatever, you know what I'm saying, and, and getting it in. You know what I mean? All the, all the, um, that, that 80s thing that happened, we survived that too. You know what I'm saying? Went through it, you know what I mean? And came out still shining. So it's all love, baby. BX all day. Yeah. Well, I know you're not necessarily a stranger to this particular establishment. I know once here, man, you've been here before and everything. Also now, Bronx Royalty, and also being inducted to the Hall of Fame and all that, man. Oh, yeah, no doubt. You know, I got a sign up on the Grand Concourse with my name on it. <laughs> so you know what I mean? I ain't that far from home. You know what I mean? Um, th this is the, the degree grand opening of the uh, Paradise Stone. Um, they were doing shows here last year. Me and Melly Mel performed here together um, last year with a whole crew of um, old school artists, Force MCs and, and cats like that. And um, Notice he just, said Force MCs. Ah, yeah. Ah. yeah you know, I, I, got, I got to keep it a buck in a quarter, you know what I'm saying? And that's what they is to me, always, you know? And um, it, it was a great show. And then to be back here, man, like I said, to, to, to open it back up with Charlie Wilson, that's that's butter. That's butter right there. That, by that respect, man, I'm also, man, I'm just filled with angst right now. I see, man, also the great production legend, man, Easy Mo B, man. You just, like, your hand just touched so much legendary works, man. You, 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 I'm saying. <laughs> let, me, let me give him a quick rundown, including productions on my man Grandmaster Cass. You know what I mean? We got Notorious B.I.G., Ready to Die, um... The the the, the, se the, 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 the second Everything. album, ready. Uh, um, Life after death. You got Tupac, Me Against the World. You got Buster Rhymes. Yo, Moby, man, drop that. <laughs> yeah, Alicia, Alicia Keys, um, Wu Tang, um, Lost Boys, Craig Mack, Flavor in Your Ear. You know, a lot of a lot of work over the years, man. A lot of work, man. But um, I was real real happy to be able to um come together with this brother and um do something together with them. We have some music that's on a label called Platinum Ice right now. Tell them, Cass, tell them about the single. Uh, we got a joint called Sedgwick and Cedar based on um, birthplace of hip-hop, Sedgwick Avenue, Cedar oh, yeah. Park. 
And, um, you know, it's about the origins. It's about the beginnings, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Got my man Jay, the boss father, on there, opening it up, you know, and then I come in and just, just smash the rest of it, you know what I'm saying? But, I mean, hopefully that's just the first and a, and a whole lot of work that me and Mo B going to be doing because, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, I'm ready to get this next album in right now, you know what I'm yeah. saying? I mean, it's... I, I'm, I'm tired. I'm tired of here. I'm, if, if you're tired of something, that means you're supposed to do something about it. Don't sit around complaining. Right. So I ain't going to sit around complaining. I'm going to give you something to replace that bullshit with that you are living through right now. I'm glad you brought that up because even in your own right, you know what I'm saying, man, because this great, as we see this dynamic shift going on in the industry right now, what's happening, this is the age of the independent. Like I say all the time, man, and I'm filled with eggs, man, just to know you're collaborating, you know what I'm saying, with the brother Mo B here and bringing it back to the essence, man, of real hip-hop and if, if anybody can do it man it should be a cat like this and y'all putting it together because i mean with you and everything with your and i'm saying with your style and your sense of flavor and everything with this brother's production is just yeah. that's that's official right there well that's what i'm trying to do we're trying to make history again yeah. again yeah. i want to give a big shout out to my man ab money down there in south carolina tommy casey i see you as far as um something brand new that i got going on called Black Box Records. Big shout out to Damon and Tampa Jackson. You know what I mean? Janie Jennings, I see you. You know what I mean? I mean as far as that and everything with Black Box and everything and stuff, because a lot of cats out here is grinding and everything. Just the, con just the concept, the idealization of saying they're trying to get at Mo. Is Mo accessible, you know what I'm saying? As far as are you looking for artists, you know what I'm saying? Can cats get at y'all? Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, you could catch me on, on Facebook. I'll be on there with the the <laughs> constantly interesting statuses <laughs> and creating forms of discussion and all that. <laughs> yeah. But um anybody that, that um wants to, to get at me you can check out easymobi.com. You can find me on Facebook. I'll be on MySpace. And I never really really was on a, a little internet guru or anything like that, but I think I'm going a little crazy with it now. I'm realizing how great a how great a tool it is. You got websites or that's the new wave. I mean, me, I mean, come on. I don't even look for me. You know what I mean? <laughs> you see me, you see me, goddamn it. That's what <laughs> Now, you know, I'm on the usual MySpace, you know what I mean? I'm on Facebook, you that's know what right, I mean? That's right, that's right. I, I mean, you can even Twitter me. You might be a while before I get back, but you know what I mean? I, 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 I put it up there. I put it up there, you know what I mean? I, I ain't regular. I, I figured it has been a month went by. People yeah, tweet yeah, me. Yeah, I'm, I'm, right. I'm not, but, to um, the, I'm not to the point where I'm tweeting. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not on Twitter. Like, I set up the page. But I'm really the Facebook dude right now, you know what I mean? So that's what's happening. You know what I mean? Call me on the phone. Yeah, because you ain't the phone. Yeah, you know you already know. Hey, can't call it you, do you? It was a long time ago, this girl that I met. Yeah, I click. You can be calling me, hey, yo, Cass, the cold crowd. I'll be click. Say what the fuck you gonna say, man. Don't play on the phone, man. You know what I mean? Nah, they don't want it. They don't want it. They don't want it. They don't want it. I mean, yeah, I mean, I'm kind of, you know, I, I, I've been doing this for a long, long, long time, okay? And I, like, I'm really, the, the, you know, the, the, the extra stuff I'm really not so much with, you know, as, as I get older, you know what I mean? I don't need all the, you know, the cameras and interviews and the, you know what I'm saying? It's cool. I know you people got jobs to do, and it's an aid to us when we have something that we want to, Put it's out my there. Pleasure, man. Come on, man. But, I mean, I'm sneaking under the rope trying to stand there. <laughs> you know what I'm it's all love, man. Right? And let me tell you, there's a lot of people walking around here who people don't give a damn about taking their picture mm -hmm. or talking to them. So as long as people want to put a camera in my face, as long as they want to put a mic in front of me, as long as they want to talk to me, I'm going to be there. I'm going to see, I'm going to make myself available for that. You know That's what right. I mean? Y'all wake up and y'all recognize, man. Legendary Grandmaster Kaz, man. Cold Crush Brothers. One of the first that I ever seen or knew of rapping and mixing on the mm. turntables at the same time. Indeed. What you know about that? Mm -hmm. What y'all know about like that? Like I said before, the first cast I seen, man, going to a show, you know what I'm saying, using pyrotechnics in the show. They come out with suits, with stage prop guns, and Tommy guns and everything. Also, that and that stuff. Rich and new what about the music? <laughs> what about the music, uh, though? What about the music, the though? The man. Exactly, oh, man. That's what it is, man, and that's what it was. But, yo, we want to get back to our shows and to our ladies, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Yo, enjoy hip-hop, you know what I mean? For what it is and for what it ain't, you know what I mean? Because you know what? 
it could be gone. You know what I'm That's saying? Right. It That's could right. be gone. It could be not here. And if it wasn't here, look at all the stuff y'all would have missed. Mm. Oh, yeah. Over these past 35 years, if there was no hip-hop, look at all the stuff you would have missed, okay? You feeling that now? Okay, now appreciate it.